Hey guys, it's Bella from Bella's Toy Chess. Back from the toy show. So let's see what I got. The toy show was located in Lakeland. Um, and I think it was from 9 to 4. It was really cool. I had a good time. Um, picked up a lot of really cool stuff. What should I start with first? This awesome Bride of Frankenstein. Yeah, I don't think they work. Let's see. No, oh, she doesn't work, but I picked her up. I needed her and Frankenstein to complete my collection, which is really cool that they had these. My other, other buddy, um, Mark, picked up the other three that they had, so we kind of just split them. Got them for $20 a piece. Um, her hair's really messed up. I wanted to brush it, but... And then, so at the toy show, there was a lot of vendors there. And they had Transformers, Star Wars, He-Man. They had everything. There was a lot of modern stuff there, too. But, I mean, overall, like I said, it was a good show. I picked up this really cool um, Transformer ice cream truck. I know on the price tag, you guys saw that it said 30 The guy actually gave it to me for 20 so that's really cool. I've never seen one of these. Um, I kind of just bought it because it says, uh, suck my popsicle. <laughs> See that? It was just funny. So I picked this up. It's a lot of little brown bags. So I went ahead and picked this up as well. I do believe it's the, yeah, the vintage one from 1983. And then I got this really cool uh, Duncan Batmobile. This is, the bottom's like really scratched. But the lady, she gave it to me for $10. And I just wanted to add it to my Batman collection. So I got this too. I need a replacement sticker on that. Definitely collect Batman. And then I got this Optimus Prime. And this was from a really good friend, Austin, who um, is the owner of Retro Rat. So here's how it goes. That's pretty cool. And I don't have the black one because this is a G2. So I definitely needed to pick that up. They had so much stuff there. I think, I think though, my opinion, there was a lot of modern stuff compared to vintage stuff. And then this is a Porsche slut car. I went by the first time and the guy told me that it was sold. And then I went back a little bit later, as you can tell. Let's see slot car and he said okay I'll sell it to you because the other guy never came back so I was like all right well got myself a Porsche slot car um and then I ended up buying earrings even though I only wear gold um definitely had to pick them up let's put these oh they fell out okay so, I got the gizmo ones. Then I got the courage. Cowardly dog. Because, I mean, I love that cartoon. Really cute. So, I picked those up. I'm trying to organize my trash here. Then I got this really 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 white wampa vintage of course look how white it is Let me hold it to the light over there it's probably the whitest one that i have slide him back in the bag i just got a whole box of stuff i put it in this box because i uh so these were, the price tag says 15 for the snow, troop, 
stormtroopers, sorry. And I picked up all of these and the guy gave them to me for 30 bucks. All five. So that's a great deal. They have no weapons. I mean, they're pretty clean. And then I picked up this Shogun Warrior. Five dollars. And one of my friends, Mark, he picked up one for seven, I believe. So I gotta find hands for it. So if anybody has hands for it, it is the metal one. Um, it says made in Japan. I don't know the year, but I know it's vintage, but look how clean that is for $5. Then I just picked up just some transformers. Some ones where you gotta rub them. Yeah, you rub the tops of them. So I just got a couple of transformers. Then I found this because this is the uh, new for 20. They have one coming out in uh, Target that's Panther that is supposed to be furry. Definitely need to find that one or find out where to pre-order it. So this was really cool. I like this one. It's really big. It's retro play. Back is really nice. I thought that I would see a lot of these there, but honestly, there wasn't. Then I got this. This is probably one of my favorite pieces that I bought there. Um, Weird Science Shit Toe Chet. Look at this. Who doesn't love this fat little shit toad? Yeah, this is really cool. It glows in the dark, so I need to leave it out. It's from Super 7. Let's see, look at that. I just, I, I don't know. I just love it. He said it was an exclusive. I saw this, but when I went to order it or look to see if you could order it, it was already sold out. So that's the only, this is the only one I've seen there too. Nobody else had this on their table. And then last but not least, I picked these up because everybody knows that I love mystery boxes and this, I bought the entire box filled. 15 of the Eternia Heroic Wars or Evil Warrior minis for $45. So I will be opening these um, in my next video. So stay tuned for that because this thing is awesome. I love it. Um, I'm hoping to get the Hordes Zombie He-Man, but we will see. They have Trap Draw, Jitsu, Skeletor, Ra Ram Man, Buzz Off, He-Man, and Man at Arms. So this box is just really cool. Um, trying to find these in Walmart, they're impossible to find. So I figured 45 bucks, you get 15 of them, might as well. But that's 15 of them that I'm opening. Ugh. But if I open them and then I end up getting um, all eight, I probably won't open up the rest, but who knows? But these were really cool. Just look at the box. Okay, that's for the next segment. Um, again, that show was really cool. I liked everything about it. My uncle came with me, Brandon. Thank you so much for filming me while I was at the show. It was funny. People thought uh, he was my bodyguard, but he was my uncle. So I hoped you liked the interview I did with him. And it's just cool to take him to his first show that he's never been to. He liked it, as you could tell in the video, but I had fun. There is another show coming up, I believe, in September or November at the Florida State Fairground. It is a two-day event, so I will let you guys know about that if you guys can make it out. And that is in Tampa, Florida. Um, again, when I find out all the details, I'll let you know. Don't forget to check my link below because I have a uh, OF, um, and you definitely want to subscribe to that. But the link is below. Um, again. Don't forget to check out the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you liked everything I bought. It wasn't a lot of stuff like normal. Um, I'm, you know, trying not to go overboard when I go to shows, but everybody who knows me knows that I do buy a lot of stuff. Again, I'm Bella. Thanks for watching. Bye.